Diamonds really are forever. They're the most durable gem on earth. When you buy one, it's because you want it to last. In 2010 alone, brides and grooms spent nearly $10 billion on engagement rings and wedding bands. We're with Salim Shami of Laviano Jewelers to find out more. This is a huge investment. It is. It is because you're going to wear it for the rest of your life. How much should we be spending on engagement rings? We hear that two months, three months salary is tradition, but what are you seeing? It depends on how much money you make. Don't go beyond your ability to. It depends that if you prepare yourself to spend $10,000, Put that $10,000 on a side for you and make sure that you'll get the best product of this $10,000. A diamond's rarity, and therefore its price, is determined by four unique characteristics, the four C's. Carrot, clarity, color, and cut. What's the first thing everyone should do? They should educate themselves about what is the combination of the diamond and where is it found and how is it cut. What's the most important criteria? Well, the make of the stone, which is the cut of the stone. Round is the most brilliant and it gives you the most dispersion of colors. When you buy diamonds, every stone has its own certificate. This is, as, as they say, the Bible of the industry. It gives you the measurement, it gives you the carat weight, it gives you the color grade, it gives you the clarity grade, it gives you the cut grade. You know, these days with the economy, um, you know, it's tough to make this splurge. But as they say, a diamond is forever. You believe that? Yes, I do. It is really a from the heart. And that's why it is for life. As for cut and color, those are more personal choices, perhaps best decided by the person who's actually going to be wearing the ring. Now, do you have any questions about buying an engagement?